So in this video I'm going to show you how to download and install your driver for your Oki Color Painter printer. So this is really easy to do and the driver is available on the Oki website. So to do this I'm going to go to the Chrome and then I'm going to go to the Oki Europe website. The best way of getting to this is just to go to Google and just type in Oki Europe or use this here. So once we're on the Oki website we want to go to the support tab. In the support tab we want to go down to drivers and utilities and then we want to go to large format printers. In large format printers you then want to make sure that you're choosing the correct printer. If you have an E-series you want to go for the Color Painter E64S. Likewise if you have a H-series you want to go for the H2 and depending on what size you've got as well. So for this demo I'm going to go to the Color Painter M64S. Open up that link and that will take you to the drivers and utilities window. So the first thing we've got is our driver which is the Color Painter PNP driver. Underneath that we have the CP Manager download and I've got a different video which shows you how to download and install for CP Manager. So I'm going to go to the driver, I'm going to go to download here. I'm then going to go to download upon agreeing with this software agreement. That will then start your download. Once it's downloaded, go to show in folder and it will then give you a zipped PNP driver folder. It will not work if you try and link the zipped driver to the printer. You have to unzip it. Easiest way of doing that is either to go to your unzip or your ext extract function or you can literally open up the file, right click on it, copy the actual file and I normally put it onto my desktop. Once it's on your desktop we're then ready to install it on your printer. The best way and the easiest way of doing this is to go to your start menu and this is exactly the same for Windows 10 computers as well. So start menu and then I normally just type in printers and you'll find that the control panel item for devices and printers pops up. That will open this box here. Now I don't actually have a Seiko or Oki printer connected to this computer at the moment but to show you this I'm going to go to the stereo microphone that I'm using at the moment. It's the same same system. So your printer will come up in this unspecified section at the bottom and it will come up and the name will be SIIP and that will be your printer. So to open it, right click on it and go to properties. You then need to go to your hardware, then down to your properties tab and then back up to your driver and then you can update driver. Here you can then go to browse my computer for driver software. You then find your um, driver which is on your desktop. So go to browse, find the driver, press next and it will install it for you. And that is all you need to do. The best way of then seeing whether this has worked is to open up your CP manager window. If it finds it straight away then everything's good. If not just repeat process and see if you can get it working from there. 